Just a day later, the driveway to Ronald Thornton's home is chained and blocked off. Why this 73-year-old man was shot and killed inside his home is the question investigators and neighbors want answered. Well, I was really sad, and I, I just couldn't believe it happened. You know, I really hated that it did happen. To Sue Snyder, Ronald Thornton was the perfect neighbor. He was a nice man. He got along with everybody that I know of. But Tuesday morning, her neighbor's home of 35 plus years on Pea Ridge Road was the center of a homicide investigation. State police say the Franklin County Sheriff's Office responded to the house just before six in the morning after someone called 911 but didn't say a word. Although there was, uh, there was nothing said over the line, uh, we do believe it was the victim um, inside of his, his home. Once they arrived, investigators found Thornton. He had been shot several times. He died while he was still inside his home. For hours, his house was blocked off as crews collected evidence, trying to piece together what happened. We're conducting interviews, doing a neighborhood canvas. Uh, we're collecting all pertinent evidence. We've gathered a, a lot of pertinent information that's going to be really useful to our to our investigation. For Thornton's other neighbor, reality didn't set in even after the crime tape and flashing lights. I didn't think it could be him. I thought it might be somebody else. With investigators expected to be in the area in the coming days to collect more evidence, neighbors like Snyder say they're still stunned by what happened. I haven't been that way since he since it happened, so. I'm sure it will be very sad to pass by there. Shaquille Lord, WLKY News.